Hi everybody, this is Doris with Rich and Love Fashion. And on this week's episode of Dose of Doris, we're gonna be talking about how 2020 is the reset. The reset for many of us. And what if I told you 2020 hasn't been canceled? Sure, we have statewide closures and events have been canceled, but what if 2020 is the year that we get our mindset right? The year that we let go of overextended toxic relationships or friendships, or maybe the year that we start that side project or side hustle that we've been wanting to do for years, but we just never got around to it. What if 2020 is that year? And what if some of us are missing that? What if we're so focused on current affairs that we're missing that 2020 is our reset? It's our time to push control, alt, delete, and create a better version of ourselves. So how do we start doing that? Well, I guess the only thing you can do is get a clear direction of where you want to go. So in previous episode, we talked about the goal card and that basically is your GPS for, you know, achieving goals. So I would highly recommend you going to that video. I'll leave a link below and you can watch that and that'll help you set goals better. I think the second part of this would have to be is taking a hard, hard, long look at your current situation in your life and just be honest with yourself and ask yourself what isn't working for you and what is. And then when you get that list or you get those thoughts written down on paper, be grateful and just say thank you. Just say thank you out loud to the universe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I am blessed. I am so happy and grateful now that X, Y, and Z is working for me. Just have that sense of gratitude. Then when you look on the opposite side, just look at that with a clear mind. And no matter what isn't working for you, just take a deep breath in, take a deep breath out. Just let it go. Let it go and know that 2020 is not the year to make this relationship work or make this, you know, whatever that isn't working for you. You're just going to have to just know you've done what you could and just move on and let it go. If it's meant to stay in your life, a part of your destiny, you know, part of 2020 and 2021, what's not working for you will circle back and come back to you. Trust me, it will. But if you keep on focusing on what is not working for you, you are only lowering your vibration. You're keeping your mind set on what isn't working for you. And we all know what you want wants you. So you are always attracting what you want. So please stay on that side of what is working because what is working is going to attract more things to work for you versus what's not working. Letting go is very hard. I will be the very first person to say it is the hardest thing that you can do is let go. But if you know your future is dependent on it, then you'll start making those decisions because don't wait to 2021 to let go or to change certain things. Change now. We still we still have the rest of 2020 to start again. So don't wait to, oh, I'll wait to 2021 to do that, or oh, I'll do that in 2021. No, do it now. Do it now. Make the decision now to focus on what's working for you, manifest more, and be in that high vibration, and look at that list of what isn't working for you, and be content with it, and be like, you know what, it's not working it's okay. I'm just going to put it over here. And if it's meant to be, it'll come back. I hope the point that you've received today is that we have the power to change the narrative in our lives. And remember, we create the world that we want to live in. We are the directors of our movie. We have the power to push, control, alt, delete, and reset. I hope this has helped. And thank you for watching this week's episode of Dose of Doris. Additional information can always be found by visiting richandlovefashion.com. And until we meet next time, remember to always stay glamorous.